Abnormal psychology is the branch of psychology that deals with the study of unusual patterns of behavior, emotion, and thought. These patterns may not necessarily indicate a mental disorder, but they deviate significantly from what is considered typical or culturally accepted. The goal of abnormal psychology is to understand these deviations, their causes, and their effects on individuals and society. Let's look at some key areas of study within abnormal psychology. The first is anxiety disorders. These can include generalized anxiety disorder, panic disorder, and phobias. They involve excessive fear or worry that can interfere with daily life. For instance, someone with a phobia might go to great lengths to avoid a specific object or situation, even if it means disrupting their routine. Similarly, abnormal psychology studies common mood disorders such as depression and bipolar disorder. Depression is characterized by persistent feelings of sadness and loss of interest in activities, impacting a person's ability to function. Bipolar disorder involves extreme mood swings from high, mania, to low, depression, which can be very disruptive to one's life. Let's look at two key strengths of abnormal psychology. The first strength is its comprehensive approach to understanding mental health. By examining a wide range of behaviors and conditions, abnormal psychology provides a deep and broad understanding of human behavior. This comprehensive perspective helps in identifying the underlying causes of mental health issues, leading to more effective treatments and interventions. Another strength is its focus on evidence-based practices. Abnormal psychology relies heavily on scientific research and clinical studies to understand and treat mental health conditions. This emphasis on empirical evidence ensures that the methods used are based on solid research, increasing the likelihood of successful outcomes for individuals receiving treatment. Despite its strengths, abnormal psychology faces criticism. One major criticism is the potential for labeling and stigmatization. Diagnosing individuals with mental health conditions can lead to labels that carry negative connotations. This stigmatization can affect how individuals view themselves and how they are perceived by others, potentially leading to social exclusion and discrimination. Another criticism is the cultural bias present in some diagnostic criteria. Mental health conditions and behaviors are often defined based on Western norms, which may not be applicable to individuals from different cultural backgrounds. This cultural bias can lead to misdiagnosis or inappropriate treatment, as the symptoms and expressions of mental health conditions can vary significantly across cultures.